Do you get mosquito bites during the summer? If so, you're not alone. In this video, we'll share some home remedies for treating mosquito bites that can help provide relief. These remedies are all natural, so you don't have to worry about harmful chemicals. So watch the video to learn more, and then try some of these remedies yourself. Mosquito bites are small, red welts on the skin when a mosquito bites you. These bites are usually itchy and can leave behind a rash or hives. Mosquitoes also carry diseases such as West Nile and Zika, which can be transmitted to humans. The bites can be irritating and cause the skin to itch. If you want to reduce the itching, it's crucial to treat the bites as soon as possible. Here are the best home remedies for treating mosquito bites. 1. Apply tea tree oil directly to the affected area. Tea tree oil is very effective in treating mosquito bites because of its anti-inflammatory properties. It is a natural disinfectant that can kill the bacteria that cause the symptoms. It is a natural remedy for insect bites and can be applied to the skin without causing adverse effects. Apply the oil to the bitten part and leave it for about 15 minutes. Wash the area with warm water and dry it. Repeat the process twice a day until you start seeing improvement in your symptoms. 2. Use a mosquito bite spray that is made with eucalyptus oil and witch hazel. Mix the spray in a spray bottle and spritz it on the affected area during your morning routine. This mixture will numb the pain and help prevent future infections. It will kill the bacteria that cause the itch and spread of disease. It also helps with the pain and swelling. The numbing effect reduces the amount of pain and swelling while leaving the skin clear. 3. Apply aloe vera gel to the affected area. Aloe vera is a natural antiseptic and anti-inflammatory. It is very soothing and helpful in reducing the pain, itching, swelling, and redness. This gel is rich in vitamins, which are very important for healing. It can be applied directly on the skin or mixed with coconut oil to make a soothing balm, soothing your skin and reducing the redness. 4. Wash the affected area with water and then with a mild soapy solution. Washing the affected area with a mild soapy solution is very soothing and will also cleanse your skin. It will help to get rid of the infection and reduce redness. The solution can also cleanse the skin before applying any other remedy. 5. Make a paste with baking soda and water and apply it over the bite. Baking soda is a natural antiseptic and will help to neutralize the infection. You can also reduce swelling by applying it to the affected area. Apply the baking soda paste immediately after the bite but before symptoms appear. This soda is very caustic, so that it can burn and injure your skin. If you wait too long to apply the paste, you may have a more severe infection. Mix 1 teaspoon of baking soda into 1 liter of water. Ensure the paste is as thick as possible without becoming too stiff or sticky. Wash away the infected bite area with the paste. 6. Apply a mixture of honey and hot water to the bite. Honey is an antibiotic, and it also has anti-inflammatory properties. It helps stop the infection from spreading by killing off the bacteria that cause disease. Mix honey with water in a ratio of 1 to 5 to 1 to 3. Apply the mixture to the bite and leave it on for 20 minutes. Then wash it off with warm water. 7. Apply vinegar to the bite. Vinegar is an antiseptic and antibacterial agent. It is therefore very effective at killing off the bacteria that cause infection. Mix 1 teaspoon of vinegar with a liter of water. Apply the mixture to the bite and leave it on for 20 minutes. Then wash it off with warm water. 8. Clean the affected area with a mixture of lemon and water. Lemon juice is acidic, so it effectively kills off the bacteria that cause infection. This juice is also an effective astringent that can shrink swollen skin. The mixture should be fresh lemon juice squeezed into a bowl of cool water. Apply the solution with a cotton swab to the bites and leave it on for 5 minutes. Rinse with warm water and pat dry. 9. Apply calamine lotion to the affected area and cover it with a bandage. Calamine lotion is a good cure for itching and burning caused by mosquito bites and stinging insects. It is also an effective remedy to prevent infection. 
The lotion should be applied to the area before bedtime, so it will have time to absorb into the skin. 10. Use neem oil on the affected area and cover it with a bandage. Neem oil is made from the seeds of the neem tree, and it's known to be an effective insect repellent. This oil can treat skin problems like acne, eczema, and rashes. Also, you can use it to treat insect bites, rashes, and wounds because it has antimicrobial properties. Apply neem oil on the affected area, cover it with a bandage, and leave it for 30 minutes before washing it off. 11. Make a paste with turmeric and water, and apply it over the bite. Turmeric is a potent anti-inflammatory agent that can help reduce swelling and itching. It also has antioxidant and antibacterial properties that help kill the bacteria that cause skin irritation. To make a turmeric paste, you need to grind some turmeric in a mortar, pestle, or grinder. Then mix it with water and apply it over the bite. 12. Apply fresh garlic to the affected area and cover it with a bandage. Garlic is a wonderful remedy to treat mosquito bites. It is also an effective natural remedy for several skin ailments. The best way to use garlic is by applying fresh garlic juice to the affected area. To do so, you can crush some garlic into strips and apply the juice to your bite. It would be best if you also covered this with a bandage to keep the garlic in place for a few hours. Keep in mind that you should not use pure garlic since it can be harmful to your health. Instead, it would help if you used the juice from the crushed cloves of raw garlic. 13. Take a piece of ripe papaya and apply it to the affected area. The enzyme papain in papaya is an effective natural remedy for several skin ailments. Because of its enzyme content, Papaya is a good remedy for mosquito bites. The best way to use papaya is by applying fresh papaya juice to the affected area. Crush some papaya and apply the fluid to the affected area. 14. Apply a hot compress to the bite area. A hot compress is an excellent way to relieve the pain and swelling from a mosquito bite. The heat from the hot compress can kill all the pathogens in your skin. You should apply a hot compress to the bite area for about 15 minutes. This way, the heat will kill all the harmful bacteria and viruses. Don't forget to put a bandage on your bite so that the heat can have time to penetrate the skin. Finally, the best way to get rid of mosquito bites is by avoiding mosquito bites in the first place. Here are some ways you can do that. Wear long sleeves and pants when you go outdoors. Keep your home free of mosquitoes. Use insect repellents on your skin every two hours, especially if you are going to be outside between dusk and dawn. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy this next video on 14 Natural Ways to Get Rid of Mosquitoes Effectively. Thanks for watching and bye for now.